From skinny teenager to South Africa's top bodybuilder, Shamin Adams knows how to transform himself. I met up with him at the Bella Rosa gym in Durbanville for some great beginner's tips. You are the perfect person to ask this. So for a lot of people starting out in training, they tend to move too quickly, too fast. How important is it to set realistic goals? The first thing I normally tell people when they, you know, when they start training, get proper advice, do a lot of reading, go onto the internet, and don't use weights that weigh too heavy for you. Now I don't want you to give away any secrets, but okay, maybe like one or two, but why is your training so successful? You know, in bodybuilding, bodybuilding, it's a marathon, it's not a sprint. It doesn't happen overnight, it takes time. It takes time. You know, in one year, you put on maximum two to two and a half kilos of muscle. The rest is basically fat you put on, okay? So it's a, it's a, it's a time process. It doesn't happen overnight. You've got to have patience in this game. Now, how do you train? Well, in the off-season, I train five days a week. Prior to contest, i say anything from 12 to 16 weeks out. I will train seven days a week, but, but I do specific body parts every day. I will do one body part twice a week, and I will spend about an hour to hour, 15 minutes maximum in the gym in the morning, and then late afternoon I'll go back to gym and I'll do another body part. Off and on season, Shamin always trains with high intensity. When not competing, he stays in shape for guest appearances and promotes bodybuilding in underprivileged areas. A lot of people think to gain a lot of muscle, they need to use heavy weight. What is your view on that? I personally don't believe in the, in the story of using heavy weights. I use a weight that I can handle. And you want to be in the sport for another 20, 30, 40 years, you know? The guys that train with heavy weights nowadays, you, they, you know, they will be in the gym for a year or two, they, they get injuries, and they might not feel it now, but the older they get, you know, the, the, the knees, the elbows, everything, the joints back up, basically. So rather use lighter weights? Definitely. Use a weight that you can handle, and where you can do at least eight to 12, even 15 repetitions at a time. Shamin started bodybuilding when he was 17 years old and entered his first competition after only three months of training. That year, he won all the shows he entered. Now, you've been in the industry for 25 years. Why did you decide to align yourself with a company like USN? Well, I've been with USN now for 10 years since the existence, basically, and I believe in the brand. Since I've started using the product, I could see when I compete internationally, I basically placed much higher in competitions, the recovery, was faster, um, muscle growth was better, and it's worldwide. I mean, uh, USN is, is basically international now. So what you see on the label is what you get inside. So I believe in the brand is a good, real, good quality product. Supplements work best for those who train hard, eat well, and rest enough. Shamin follows a very disciplined lifestyle, choosing nutritional supplements that are pure, safe, and effective. What supplements do you use during your workouts? To me, at the moment, the BCAA Vitago Brown Chain Amino Acid, it's, it's my number one product at the moment. I really love it because when you train, you actually break down muscle. And the BCAA Vitago, I will sip on it during my training because you're feeding the muscle with the amino acids that the muscle need for growth and recovery. So, you, And I like the tingly feeling it gives you under the skin as well. It just puts me on another level. Okay, so that motivates you to train? Yeah, no, definitely. And then after my training, I will use like my um, whey protein, very important as well. And then as a pre-workout, my anabolic nitro, it's very good. Now on that point, what is your view on the responsible use of supplements? Don't abuse, you gotta use. Your solids is still key, it's still number one on the list. That's why it's called a supplement to supplement your protein and your carbohydrate intake today. Visit usn.coza to read more about these and other quality supplements. Also, tune in tomorrow as Shamin gives us a special behind-the-scenes glimpse of bodybuilding competitions and all the preparations that precede it.